hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to be talking about this wig that i have on my head so if you don't follow me on instagram follow me on instagram at whitney ronaldine subscribe to this channel press a like comment down below what you think about this wig okay okay so today's video is talking about this wig now this wig i've had for over two three years something like that so if you watch my channel you will see that um i did a i did a tutorial like a kind of do this tutorial um with a long curly wig let me come up closer to you boom with a long curly wig and um this is that wig <laughs> Now, listen, I, oh my God, I'm so cloudy as hell. Okay, um, I wanted to do something different with this wig. If the color changes, I'm using natural light. So, yes, and it's kind of cloudy outside, so I need to hurry up so that I don't lose my light. Yes, so, um... I the wig was long to about waist length waist length to top of the butt um it was very curly very long and thing about buying curly wigs is that it looks nice and after a while it starts to it starts to clump up. If you're hearing somebody talking in the background, I'm, I, I humbly apologize because all of us, since somebody's talking, I'm hearing a TV playing like, can't get no peace, bitch. Anyways, yes. So, the thing about buying curly wigs is that it looks so nice and um, you wash it, curl it back, everything is awesome. But after a while, and you're trying to comb out the curls. Now the curls come out. It's still like wavy and stuff. But the curls start to tangle. So sometimes the end will look brittle or, you know. So I said, let me flip and this, this um, wig. And it looked nice. It looked very nice, you know. But the ends were still fluffed because they were done you know they processed it to look curly and um i washed it a, a lot i'm not gonna lie in two three years i washed it a lot and because you know sometimes when your hair sweats or your hair did not wash and you use the wig a couple of times you have to wash it because it doesn't smell right you know you don't want to go in a car and be like Mm. who's that is that your hair you know what i'm saying so you have to wash the wig so um that was my situation and it was straightening now but it was still looking fluffy so i said listen i'm so ups i'm so upset with myself that i didn't film the video of me doing this because I actually didn't think you were going to turn out this good. Now, as you can see, let me come down and show you. I didn't think you were going to come out this good because I tried it once before and it didn't work out. You see how it's different lengths? Some people will tell you, oh, that's not a nice cut. But this is exactly, see this? This is what I was going for. I don't want it to be too even. 
I don't want it to be too perfect, you know. Let me see if I can show you the lens. You know what I'm saying? I don't. I I like how it doesn't look perfect. I was actually going to do a bob and then curl it to make it like short hair, but I said, "Bruh, I like it like this." So when I did it like this, I was like, "Hmm," and I did it off my head as well. So, but the way how you'd seen it like this is, um, I cut off the damaged parts of the ends so because it was so long i cut it in stages i got it in four different stages so i cut the first half then i cut the second half and then i combed it to see what it would look like do not um cut hair wet i didn't do that because i waited it dried i blow dried it and then i cut and styled the hair so after cutting it and then I reached the last stage, which is the third, um, the fourth stage. Um, I realized that it won't look straight, and I was like, I don't think I want it straight. Because honestly, if I have to do this straight, ooh, if I have to do this straight, it'll be like this. I mean, obviously, I wouldn't think it like that, but it will be as short as this. And that's kind of what I was going for. I was actually going for something like this. So that I could just wear it down. And I was like, bruh. You know it like hair. Um, I was trying to do short hair and stuff like that. But I'll do short. I'll do short curly hair instead. Um, even if I do a short wig, I'll have a different wig so yes um and the way how it looks like this is because i just cut off the damage head because when i was trying to even it out so i said okay let me see what i could do to the hair cut off the damage ends and i realized the ends was looking jagged and i watched it and i was like let me even out the hair and i don't know Something just tell me, try on the wig. So they're going to cut it in the bobby. Eh? So they try on the wig. So I put it on, comb it out, try it on. And I loved how it was different lengths. Because, I don't know, the perfection is in the imperfection. You know, I don't like, everything looks nice when it's so, you know, straight and it's so this and it's so that. But I also wanted some type of length because, as you can see, it's kind of, it's hitting me, like, mid-back. You know, it's hitting me mid-back. So, I wanted some type of length still, um, without being too long. But I also, I just wanted to damage parts off of it because it wasn't looking like I was plaiting it and folding it up. But the hair was so heavy as he used to run the wig back. But I don't know, it just it just wasn't working for me. So when I cut it like this, I realized that it was jagged, and I was like, listen, I love this look. And I've worn this since I've cut it. I've worn this like One in ten times, <laughs> you understand? Like most of them, I would take it and put it up and clip it, so you will just see the short ends taken on the top. And then um, I went up and I had it down. I didn't have this style though, this braided style, but I had these thing in the back there, and then I had the rest come down like this, and it was looking snatched so the thing about me is that i this is gonna sound bad but i don't really conform to what people ideas and thoughts are of certain things you know when i see something that i like i i try it i do it i use it 
you know but um this week is a this week was a 22 inch i know this look like a she what is this could be about 16 to 18 inches okay like certain parts is 18 and certain parts is 16 so let's just say 16. let's say in between 16 and 18 so let's say something like that so i love it and i did this style of course i didn't film it once again but i filmed me flat ironing this hair sickening and then i filmed me doing this look although i had a different lip so when i post this video i will link this hair tutorial well it's not like a tutorial because i just flat ironed the hair so i will link that below as well as this makeup look had a nude lip but i said i decided mm, i kind of wanted this look but then i was like oh my gloss all the way over there and i just i couldn't <laughs> so and oh and by the way i wanted to say in a video so that i won't forget that this is my lip gloss so i lined it with I didn't even plan to do this. This is just party moment, as you can see in most of my videos. I lined my lips with this lip liner in medium brown. And then I took the is this? Petroleum, petroleum jelly. And this is the look. This is the lip. This also keeps your lips hydrated and it keeps um, your lips feeling soft. And especially with this heat that passing nowadays, you don't really want your lips to crack. So that I get a lip balm. Lip balm is kind of basically the same thing. But it's kind of like you get a lip balm or this. I prefer this because this is like. This is practically like a natural product for your hair, bitch. Just slap some of this on your lip. And it, so you have the shine light lip gloss. So you look like you're wearing lip gloss. But you're also protecting your lips. Treats. You're welcome. Anyways, this is it on this hair. But I'm going to be trying um, curly hair. The stuff. Listen, you don't even know what coming for you. You don't even know. You don't even know. I, I want to do some more hair tutorials. So more of that will be coming. I'll be spitting out the hair like nobody's business. But I also wanted to try a frontal because I never did a frontal. I did a closure. This is like, what the thing is this? Oh, this is my hair, you see. So when you see the discoloration, like this is the makeup, and this is my hair. I don't put it in my roots today because I didn't feel like putting it in my roots. Okay, don't sue me. Yeah, um, I want to try different hair styles, which I have done a lot of hairstyles over the past years. But since I am on YouTube, I've done a couple of styles. Like I've done the long hair when this was long. I've done this. I've done the um the box braids multiple times. I've done the Afro Kiki twist box braid. Um I did the the four locks. What else did I do? What else did I do? I did oh I did a curly weave. Did I? I think I had that. No, I don't think I had this channel yet. I've done Instagram, so follow me on Instagram, Albert Nero Aldine. 
Um, I think I did that clearly, yeah, you know. But I'm not sure. Something else I do. But anyways, yes, I want to be trying different hair styles. And um, I also wanted to try a silk press on my natural hair. So, <laughs> lots more video coming for you. So just get excited for that. And um, I realize that my hair videos get more attraction than my makeup. Although my makeup ain't on point all the time, you know. Uh, I ain't a guru or nothing like that. I mean, I could shake a little bit. You see this? I could shake a little bit, but you know. Um. Oh, also going makeup shopping. Stay tuned. But I will do like a vlog style, but it won't be like vlog vlog. It could just be like me in the me in the um makeup store choosing all different makeup. And it, so I'll do a mini vlog for you. Um, it wouldn't be a vlog like, oh, go into the beauty store and then see me on the way and all these things. No. So you just see me in the store choosing different things. You'll see how the store looks and whatever. And then you'll see everything that I get. And then when I get home, I'll do a video on the new stuff that I got. So, see, I have a lot coming. A lot. So, stay tuned for that, you know? Anyhow. <laughs> uh, subscribe to this channel. <laughs> and I'll see you guys. Why keep on saying you guys? I'm watching too much YouTube. I'll see y'all. I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.